From protests, thousands of petitions and parliamentary pressure, the little village of Ryarsh has been the centre of more than a year of debate around proposals to build a huge quarry on its doorstep. But now a major breakthrough could be on the horizon. Now the plans originally suggested here on my computer here that this whole area behind me would have been allocated for the quarry. However, if we look at the most recent report from Kent County Council on this proposed site, it says at the bottom that it is concluded that the Westmoreland Ryash site should not be allocated. And in fact, if you look even deeper, it says that it's an inappropriate development. I think that the planning people at KCC have done a very good job. They've been very thorough in trying to investigate everything that's been raised. And their initial conclusions indicate that they don't think that Raj would be a good site for the quarry because it's green belt. And the other thing which is encouraging is that the demand for sand looks as though maybe we may be able to meet it from sources that are already being mined or already being dug out so it does sound like good news the site was one of a number proposed by kent county council to help meet a desperate shortfall in sand required to build materials but more than three and a half thousand residents signed a petition against the three million ton sand pit petitions which were now handed to the government by tunbridge and morning mp tom tugendhat no doubt all those who signed will be pleased Kent County Council's draft minerals and waste local plan doesn't include this site. Therefore, the petitioners ask the House of Commons uh, to urge Kent County Council to reconsider the allocation of a site for quarrying in Ryarsh, West Morling, Kent. The report by KCC, which will be discussed tomorrow, states that an alternative site of Chapel Farm in Lenham has been identified and is considered acceptable, in principle, to meet sand material requirements in Kent. Ryash residents won't be getting ahead of themselves until the final decision is made though, but on the surface at least, it seems Lenham could be top pick for the pit. Harry Pete for KMTV.